Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, my illustrious, beautiful family. Welcome y'all to the mental health. With me, your host, DJ. I'm not going to be on here very long. And I'm sure y'all, a lot of y'all, uh, well, whatever diaspora that you on, first of all, let me welcome A lot of y'all think I'm going to trash Jesse. Jesse, Jesse, Jesse. A lot of y'all are going to do enough of that. So you don't need me to do that. And I try to try to stay away from that as much as I can. But y'all know I ain't come from heaven. I come from hell just like the rest of you. So sometimes I I use I come in my lower self. I try not to. I try to stay in my higher self as much as possible. But you know, sometimes we all fall short. Okay. But let me say this about Brother uh Jesse. Um, you know, part of being a good performer. And a good artist is having a certain amount of narcissism. Um, there's certain parts of your personality um, that has been challenged a lot of times from childhood. A lot of times not. But a lot of thespians and a lot of um, people that are artists are, um, you know, a little narcissistic. And a little dramatic, should I say. Um... Kind of like when you see Becky make those real big tears and ain't nothing happened. But if for the effect, she may cry a lot. They're, they're, they're emo they can take their emotions and then what they do, they all hype it behind the situation. And therefore give it more validity as far as they're concerned. And what you get sucked up into is the emotion of it. Well, it didn't seem like Jesse had a lot of emotion behind him. Because I didn't see him right away. But I do know that the story took legs that I didn't believe only because I'm here in this vortex. I kind of saved my opinion because I really, first of all, didn't want it to be untrue. And second of all, um, it just sounded kind of skept you know, skeptical right out the gate. But at the same time, um, I know a lot of entertainers, especially. So for all of y'all that's getting ready to clown him, and you know you actors, singers, um, especially you actors, y'all lie all the damn time. You you talk about roles you don't have. You talk about contracts you're going to sign. You talk about deals you finna make. You lie all the damn time. So as a, a person that knew the difference, no, they had to find the hard way, the difference between singing and just show business, and then I realized that Jesse Smollett um, is just doing a show business move. They lie all the damn time. Ain't no disrespect. Sometimes the lies are harmless. Sometimes the lies include a lot of other people. Um, sometimes when you keep them contained in Hollywood, you okay because you there with people that lie all the time. But when you begin to come outside and take the madness outside the scope or the realm of where the stories are acceptable... You know, you're going to find yourself in Bellwood or you're going to find yourself arrested. <laughs> and I hope neither one of them um, uh, holds true for Jesse. And also, you don't get deported. <laughs> anyway, um, it's an unfortunate situation. And uh, like I said, it's going to make no sense for me to clown Jesse. Jesse. You already know you should have did. You should have done that. That's what you did. You already know better. We see the two African guys, the brothers, said that you paid them, and that I don't even know why they came back to these states. But they came back to once they busted. I guess their apartment. I guess they said, "Oh hell no, we're gonna get ourselves up out of this one." So the jig is up. Um, unfor it's an unfortunate thing because there's there are real things happening and all over this country with racism and all other kind of stuff. You don't need to add nothing to the pot, especially lying about it. So I find that repulsive. Okay, I do. I really find that repulsive. So with that being said, you know the chips gonna fall where they may. So you better put on your turtle suit and um. Stay still in it. Because don't do the crime if you can't do the time. Alright? With that being said, if you like what you hear, like, subscribe, and share. And I'm going to see you in the next video. Bye-bye.